welcome everybody to the first flow video. All right, so some of us are at home, yeah, right? Not at school because of certain viruses coming around. So what we are going to do for everybody out there, if you're interested, is we're going to show you a couple today. Anyway, it's going to be our first one. We are going to show you a couple of what we like to call E F games, energized, focused games. Just to get us moving a little bit. Yep. Yeah, just to get us warmed up. And something I always do in all my classes, whether I'm at the Amazing Rec Room or I'm at any one of our schools uh, with Epic Inc., wherever I go, we usually start off with these nice warm ups before any movement, music, or art activity. So we're going to show you a couple of those, and hopefully, there'll be many more to come. And we're slightly doing this live, right, Lena? Yeah. So we want to kind of have it fun and have it as if I'm actually doing the class, all right? So before we ever start anywhere, we need to do what? Do you remember, Lena? Respect our environment. Yeah, respect our environment because we need to sweep up. Yeah, so we're going to sweep up. Can you get the broom for me, honey? Yep, I right. sure can. <laughs> this is our home, by the way. AC's home right here. Oh, you got the broom? You want to use the broom pan? No, you can use it. I'll use the broom pan. So this is what we do. Kids, make sure you sweep up your area first. All right, make sure yes. it's nice and clean and tidy up, okay? So, Layla, go ahead. Sweep up our area. <laughs> Good job. This is not garbage. Yeah, here, I'm going to help you to make it go a little quicker since we're going live, okay? Layla helps us sweep up all the time. Yep. All right, there we go. Here we go. Yeah, see, that's why we're sweeping up. Stepped on something? Okay, Lena, do me a favor. Grab the pan, because i got to do this quick, because we are live. All right, you got the pan? Here we go, sweeping around. Usually, by the way, I'll do this to music. It's just I think the music might affect my voice right now, since this is the first time I'm doing it. But as we go around the room, you'll probably see. You're going to hold that for me, Lena? We're doing this together as a team, nice and tight on the floor. Okay, here we go. Yes! All right. I did a little pre-sweep already to make it go a little quicker. But let's make sure we tidy up our place before we start our stuff. All right. So now that we're all tidied up, no, we're not all Lena, this is fine. Let's go. Good job. See, this is awesome. She's still taking care of business. Lena, let's get going with her EFG. You can put those here for now, OK? Thank you, sweetheart. Spider Woman, let's go. So. What I love to do is, now again, this is going to be for a lot of different ages. So, Lena here is four. So, whether you're four, five, six, seven, nine, eight, eleven, forty-eight, thirty-two, seventeen, whatever. I like to start nice and slow, something that's easy so that we don't get too frustrated to start off with, right? Yeah. Yeah. We need so, to go calmly and still. Right. We're going to go calmly. We're going to find our groove. We're going to find our flow, our energized focus. Yeah. Okay. So, Usually when I go to the rec room, uh, which when it's open again, hopefully we'll all be going there and doing this live. I like to start off with scarves. Yeah. Lena, do we have any scarves? Yep, right there. Alright, go get the scarves. <laughs> what color would you like? Red. Red. Okay. Lena has red, goes with Spider-Man, I'll go with yellow. Hey, let's do a little bit of French here. Lena, what color is this on Francais? Jaune. Puis ça Rouge. Rouge. Yellow, jaune, red. Rouge, pretty good. However, I'm sure all of you at home are like, AC, not cool, man. We don't have all the cool toys that you have at home. But listen, this is really just a soft scarf. Now, if you're bound at home and can't go out because, you know, we're not allowed, I have some alternate things you can use besides scarves. All right? See, Lynn's already having a good time. Uh, the amazing Sonia is behind the camera right now. So Sonia, you're gonna follow me? I am. We're, we're just gonna go around the house and we're gonna see what we can use instead of a scarf, okay? Come on with me and feel free to take a look around my home while you're here, all right? Here's our music center, the best album ever. That's for you, Layla. Okay, we're gonna come out, we're gonna go to Layla's room. Come on with me. Yeah. Here we go. Okay, here's Layla's room. We're gonna pop into one of Layla's drawers and see what we have here. <gasps> Hey, these will work perfect. These could work as uh, uh, scarves as well. Oh, face cloths. Face cloths. I'm sure if you don't have kids' face cloths, we could use adult face cloths. They also work well in case you lose toilet paper. I know that's a big, uh, big scene around here. <laughs> you could also use socks. Pull I them apart. Nice soft socks. 
Or you can use underwear too, sure, make sure they're clean, okay? Socks also double up as pretty good juggling balls. My, uh, my crew over at McShane. <laughs> Love you guys, miss you very much. You'll know my little trick with the socks. Yeah. Okay, so you can use anything around the house, even big scarves, shirts, uh, tennis balls, hockey pucks, whatever you got lying around. But we're gonna use scarves today, okay? Come, Layla, right. let's go. Okay. Woohoo! I wanna use a pink cloth. Go ahead, you can use a pink cloth. See? You can switch it all up. Actually, Derek and the dominoes. If you, if you want to do it too, you can have, have my pink cloth to match my bed. <laughs> all right, so here's what we're gonna do. Lena and I will give you a little demonstration. Actually, I'll put it right here. Oh, that's good. In Thank case, you. In case Sonia wants that. All right. So, Lena, are you gonna face Daddy, please? Stand over there. No, no, stand on the floor, please. All right. So, everybody at home or wherever you might be, you take your ball, your scarf, your cloth. And your, your underwear, your socks, whatever it is you're using. And your tennis ball. Your tennis ball. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna hold this scarf up in the air. All right? Now, can you, I'll back up a bit. I'm getting the backup sign from my wife over there. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna hold the scarf up in the air, or your ball, whatever, and we're just going to go over, and let's touch our foot. If you're wearing shoes, try to touch the laces on top of your foot, okay? Let's bend over later, ready? Touch your foot. And back up. Here we go. Nice. Now we're doing the same thing, but we're going to touch the other foot. We're going to cross it over. Lena, you ready? Touch the other foot. Yeah, and up. Hey, almost like an X. Like an X, exactly. We're going to make an X. We're going to go down, straight line, up, and let's make our X. Oh, I feel a bird. <laughs> All right, now we're going to add a breathing to it. Okay, Lena, you ready? Yeah. Hands up. Take a deep breath in. When we touch your toe, we're gonna to breathe out. Breathe in, and we go up. Cross, touch your toe, up. Let's switch hands. Touch your toe, up. Switch hands, 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 touch your toe. Go, go, go as fast as you can. Stop. <laughs> all right, so you can do that as long as you feel, obviously. All right, Lena, up. Now we're gonna teach you something called orbits. Super fun, super cool. Lady, ready? Our hands are gonna go out in front of us. We are gonna switch the scarf, Lena, or the ball, or the cloth, switch again, or the underwear, or the chainsaws. I don't recommend chainsaws. <laughs> switch. Wider, 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 wider. Now when you can't go anymore, what's our trick, Lena? Go behind that we're gonna do the other hand. Woohoo! <laughs> behind the back, put the other hand. For those of you who are just learning this, let me turn around and see what I'm doing, okay? Behind the back, we switch, we bring it back to the front. All right, Layla, let's show them the front view. Behind the back, they're called orbits, into the front. So, Layla, let's go super slowly like a turtle. Now, super cat speed! Super cat speed! How fast can you go? How fast can you go? <laughs> Lena, stop and change directions. Go the other way. Can you go the other way? Cowboy can go the other way too. Yeah? Super cat speed! Go, go, go! <laughs> All right, now, here is a harder orbit. We're gonna spread our legs a bit. Let's do an orbit around one leg. Can you try that, Lena? Around just one leg? I can do that. That's pretty good, keep going. Keep going, around one leg. I'm getting tired. Good, yeah, we're <laughs> almost done. So that's one leg orbit. We can speed it up, speed it up, Ooh. speed it up. Speed it up. Ah. Oh, oh, sometimes we fall, that's okay. Now here's a tricky one as we're getting, because some of you think ACS is easy. For the ones that find it easy, we're gonna switch over to the other leg. All right, do orbits on the other leg. I don't find it easy. That's okay, if you don't find it easy, you stay on one leg. Because this could be for any age, right? Maybe you're five, six, seven, eight, or nine. If you're a bit older, we are then gonna go into my favorite one, I like to call the Infinity Orbit. It's a superhero movie, ready? One leg, other leg. One leg, and we keep switching. We're making an infinity sign. We add our breathing to it. Lena's tuckered out, she's been working all morning with us already, okay? You can do it sitting down too. Do you wanna make orbits while you're sitting? Yeah, keep going through your legs while you're sitting. This is a good move too. 
If you're a little tired, still a nice little focus focus exercise here. Going around, it's okay. Going around, around one leg, around two legs, around one leg. Now, if you're a basketball guy or you're a little bit older and you're using a ball, soccer ball, basketball, anything, socks, this is a modified version for the older ones. We try to go up and catch, Woo. up and catch. Now I like to use scarves because I throw the scarf up, it's gonna float a little bit longer than a ball. Ball goes much faster. Uh, for instance, say this is a ball. You see it goes quicker than the scarf, look. It falls down quicker. So using scarves or socks or underwear goes a bit slower and allows you to concentrate a little bit easier. Now these aren't races, these are just to get our focus up. Just to make us feel good, have a bit of a good time. Something else we're gonna to try to do a little bit. For those of you, if you're already past this stage, like you just to throw the scarf up, catch it. Throw the scarf up and catch it. Ah, you see, that's easy. I hear that all the time. Hey, see, that's easy. Lady, you wanna to try to throw the scarf up and catch it? Give it a shot, give it a shot. You tired a bit? Yeah, that's it, up and catch. Oh, almost. All right, now again, some people might find this easy. So try to throw it higher if you can. Use one hand if it's too easy, use the other hand. If that's too easy, we're gonna add a clap before we catch it. Can you try it like that? Oh, almost! AC, one clap is too hard. Try two, try three, try 50. Here's what I'd love you to do though. How about you send me your record online? Tell me, hey AC, I did five claps or eight claps, but the claps have to go before you catch it. And then try with different objects. Try with the scarf. Maybe the scarf falls down faster. Try a ball, try a Lego block, try anything. I highly discourage you trying to do this with a chainsaw. All right, some people say, AC, can you do it with a chainsaw? And I say, no, not yet. <laughs> um, so this was just our first mini little series. There's gonna be many more to come. I'm gonna to try to do these uh, once a day with the help of Lena. And muscle. We call we call Lena LFC around here. I'm AC, and behind the camera we got this is a hard one. <laughs> SBFC. <laughs> yeah, that that would be the whole SBFC behind the camera, or we're also known as the C family. All right. <laughs> so Shall stay tuned. It? You can check this out hopefully on uh, Adam. Sorry, Flow with AC on YouTube. <laughs> Flow with AC on Instagram. Flow with AC on Facebook. And you can email me anytime you want at flowwithac3 at gmail. Let me know how it went. Can you repeat that email address? Flow with AC3. I made a funny face there because I had to add a three to it because somebody already had Flow with AC Gmail. Can you believe that? So I put number three, because it's a very important number for us. Right, Lena? Yeah. Yeah. So, flow with AC3, you can email me there if you have any questions, or Instagram, Facebook, and very soon YouTube, and that's just regular flow with AC. That's this guy right here. This awesome symbol that was made by Mr. Matthew LaBerge and Matthew LaBerge Graphics. So check me out, drop me a line. Let's stay connected, stay safe, wash your hands. There'll be more flow videos to come. Lena, can we give a thumbs up out of here? Get on your bum. Get on your feet. Get on your bum one last time. Get on your feet. Get on your bum. Get on your feet. I'm tired. <laughs> That's usually what happens at the end of our classes. So, thank you very much for tuning in. We'll see you all soon. Let me know you're out there, okay? Have a good one.